welcome to another video from the farm. Now today we're putting together this vertical axis wind turbine that's arrived from China finally. Took a month to get here, but it's the cheapest possible one I could find, 80 pounds, 400 watts. Let's see if it works. This kit's got a few basic components. You've got the blades, which mount on here, with these, and then you use these bolts to mount this bit to whatever plate you want to stick it on to then stick it on a pole and then wire these three wires to these three green wires and that gives you DC electricity from AC to charge your batteries with as I said before 400 watts let's start putting this together see how well it works so it's all straightforward to put together literally slide your washer in your little lock thing on your screws line it up with a hole start screwing it in now you with this one you need to use an allen key or an allen key bit but pretty simple to do fire all these in now three on stands up nicely now now I've also gone off uh, book a little bit and I'm mounting it to a piece of wood with these spare brackets I've got but as you can see you want to make sure it doesn't hit the blades if you're putting something like that on spins all the way around nicely no interference from the extra piece if you're not doing a straight down pole I've put this on so I can mount it to a wood pole pretty easily right Let's put on the last two. Nice and tidy. Lovely jubbly. Basically all assembled now. Just got to connect these wires to the charge controller. And the only wire that's suitable that I've got knocking about. Is this stuff? It's a pretty thick gauge. So it should do nicely. Alright, let's hook this up and run the wire down the pole. Get it in position ready to plug into the charger. Okay, we're done. All set up. Connections all made. Got the controller plugged in to the multimeter at the minute. Let's stand this up now. See what sort of power we're getting. Off this sort of medium gust, I'd say we've got not very strong winds, but it's some wind. We shall see. Got it just up in the air a little bit. It's right behind the solar panels. I'm still getting, can you see? Five, six volts coming through. Spinning all right. It's time to get this jacked up in position now. Got it, everything installed now. Got it double the height. See, it's about 20 feet in the air now. Producing about 9 to 10 volts with a slight gust. So, when it pick, oh, picking up, there we go, over 12, there we go, 13, 14, oh, 15, 16. We've got all the 12 volt batteries that are old caravan batteries that had knocking around wired together now. And as you can see, we're charging. Let's have a look how much it's spinning. So it's going nowhere near as fast as it can either. And we're charging this 12 volt bank up. It's spinning and nice. Well, so far, working pretty sweet. Charging up the 12 volt batteries very nicely. So I don't foresee any issues with having a light at all in the future. We're going to be wind powered for life now. Now I'll do a little update along the line when I've got a bit more data on this and how well it works, how well it charges up the batteries and whatnot. But so far, 
recommended purchase I'd say. Cheap, easy to install and doesn't take much wind at all to get it charging stuff, get it above 12 volts. Oh big gust there, look at it go. Lots of free power. Right then, until next time.